Wilson live in Bridgeton. So you spoke to some other witnesses, people who were there, who say that customers were ducking for cover. Yeah, those customers certainly tried to hide. The victims, though, didn't have time to react. We're told they were treated on the scene and they should be okay. In the meantime, workers say they don't know why this woman was so angry when they didn't put up a fight fixing her broken nail. Imagine this is your eyesight. It's what happened to two workers at Me Holiday Nail Shop in Bridgeton after the owner says a woman angry about a broken nail went on the attack. Coming like red, he cannot see anything for a couple minutes. Bella Chen says this woman, identified by police as 29-year-old Hakira Cochran, picked up a bottle of nail polish remover and squirted it in the faces of her boyfriend and another male employee. It happened Friday when police said Cochran returned to the nail shop hours after she'd gotten a manicure and pedicure. After two hours, she come back and she say her nails broke. But, you know, the, this fake nail is not the real nail. They should be, if you hit something, they will be broke. Employees say they don't know why Cochran was so angry when they offered to fix the nail free of charge. My boyfriend tried to um, fix for her and he just say, if you be nice, we everybody nice to you because you're a customer. We, we don't want to make any argument with the customer, but she just yelling to him and just be like really angry. You can see where the acetone splashed on this chair, eating away at the fabric and color. The bottle even says it's harmful if inhaled or swallowed. Chen says other customers ran and hid while she called police. An employee locked the door so the woman couldn't leave. That's just probably one of the most uh, uh, offbeat crimes that we've had in reference, references. We've never had an incident like this happen in Bridgeton. And we cover pretty much the whole gamut. Chen says the crew is back at work, but not without fear. Yeah, I'm, I'm so scared because it never happened before. Yeah, so bizarre, right? So the suspect is charged with aggravated assault. She was released on her own recognizance and has a court date coming up. Reporting live in Bridgeton, Seanette Wilson, Fox 29 News. Seanette, thank you. Police and Delaware.